she used to sell 15 bags a day, but following the 50% increment, Alima is unable to even sell four bags. This is the story of some water sachet sellers following an increase in prices by the National Association of Sachet and Packaged Water Producers. Obviously, these hawkers have not welcomed the increment happily. Alima, who has been plying the straight for the past three years, tells me that formerly she made a profit of two CDs per bag. Although her profit will increase to three CDs per bag following the increment, customers are now unwilling to buy her water. When it was 20 pesos, I was able to sell about 15 to 20 bags. But now since the increase, I have not been able to sell four bags. Bags. I have sold only three bags since morning. Not all sachet water producers have increased the price of their products. John Carsten Sasa, supervisor for Joy Kumenua Water, explains that they would have to conduct a survey before implementing the increment. We are just want to assess things before we can increase the production price. But for production, we are doing it. There are so many factors, like the fuel, when buying the water also, water cost also is one of these two. The management will sit down, we just can't wake up and say, oh, I've increased my price. But the management have to sit down and weigh it to all round. He did, however, raise a point about the neglect of the smaller denominations of the Peswa, explaining that this has partially influenced the 10 Peswa increase. The currency we are taking, uh, people are not valuing the one Peswa, 10 Peswa in the system. So if you increase it one Peswa, nobody will, they, they don't have it. They don't have the one Peswa because we are ignoring the one Peswa in the system. That's why we are making 20 Peswas. Because if you buy, I can't change you nine Peswas. And where am I going to get the chain of the, that small, small coins? The failure to appreciate the lower denomination, that is the one Peswa and five Peswa, could be the cause of the sudden rise in prices rounding to the tenth Peswa. So we hit the street to find out if people would accept a three Peswa change if water was to be sold at 27 Peswas. Even if they will increase it, it should be around, they should increase it by, they can increase it by one Peswa, that one will be better. It's, it will sound to me as if the one, uh, the ten Peswa or the one Peswa is no more of use in the system. So it, it wouldn't be good to me. Oh, like he's only there. Never had him. And he said, hey, 20 pesos now, they are okay. Oh. This is very bad for them to increase it. If we go back to use our one peso, it will be very good. One peso is now, they are okay. So, I just bought a sachet of water for 30 Ghana pesos. I could have bought it at a lesser price, even though there is 50% increase. Some sachet water producers are attributing the 50% increase of sachet water to Ghanaians reluctant in accepting a lower denomination. That's one peso and five pesos. So I'm asking, is it the price we are paying for neglecting our lower denomination? Alberta Bissier reporting for Joy Business.